guys it's beer o'clock on ginger beer and today we are reviewing this this is a can of beer from brew york funnily enough in york it is their juice forsyth juicy bonus fruited ipa coming in at a respectable five percent in a 440 ml tin as you can see great design on the tin if i pan it round it's got the iconic outline there of dare i say bruce forsyth uh, other designs on the tin it's got a glitter ball up the top from a certain dancing program and there as well uh, there's the cuddly toy and also some playing cards just in case you happen to play those cards right if you know what i mean there i think we probably got through that without any copyright infringement if you know what i mean so a beer Juice Forsyth Fruity IPA, 5%, 440ml can from Brew York in York. Great brewery. Thank you guys for sending me some beers. I'm looking forward to reviewing these. I've got so, quite a few more and some real cracking, interesting beers to do from them. So make sure you check out the other reviews as they come up. Uh, right, let's get this out of the tin, into the glass, see what it's like. Look at that for measurement. Right, let's carefully put the tin down. So, colour wise, oh, I'm getting the smell of it already. Colour wise, you've got a straw yellow, a nice yellow, real hazy, thick sort of body. There's great carbonation, it's whooshing up the outside of the glass or the inside of the outside glass. Uh, the head, you've got a tight, bubbled, small white head, one finger, which is dissipating quite quickly but it's it's holding no, it's holding now I'll take that back it's holding quite well but a nice thick hazy body to it let's see what it's like on the aroma oh wow 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 it is tropical fruit all the way through that is like that is like a breakfast juice without a doubt not in the sense of an eye of a nipa a New England IPA that is pure pure breakfast juice there is pineapple there is grapefruit oh real real tropical look how that head has dropped now it was raging up inside the glass and the head is sort of broken down with it as you would expect if it's going to be like that but that is really really lively in the glass and it smells so juicy it's making my mouth water um, Oh, there's nothing alcoholic about the smell. It is just a really, really nice smelling or, uh, juice, fruit juice. I was going to say orange juice, but there's so much more to it. Let's dive in, see what it's like on the taste. Cheers, everybody. Oh, oh my. I'm going in again. <laughs> there is no <sighs> I'm amazed there is no alcohol push in that at all that is like drinking and who remembers Umbongo other juice tubs were available or are available Umbongo that's just like drinking that my god I'm going to have to go in again is an cracking cracking fruit juice I'm gonna stand I'm gonna stand a drink a bit I can't believe it there's no alcohol pushing that at all it is like drinking a fruit box drink it's tropical all the way through it's got quite a sharp little taste 
but it's fruity, absolutely jam-packed full of fruit. That is very enjoyable and far too easy. At 5%, far too easy to drink. I can see there being issues with this. Oh, that is very nice, very nice. Guys, try and find that one out. Like I say, it is from Brew York. It is their Juice Forsyth uh, Fruit IPA. Fruity or Juicy Bonus Fruited IPA. Coming in at 5%, as I said. Really, really good brewery. Again, thank you very much for the cans of beer, guys. A um, little bit left in the can. Put that in the glass. That is a cracking beer. Cracking, cracking beer. Really different, really interesting. I just wonder. Yeah. Yes, yeah, brought it back. That, you can hear, I don't know if you can hear it sizzling away. Look at the colour. Look at the colour on it. It is thick, creamy, hazy, but it is just 100% fruit all the way through. They have got that so right, but it is so different. The grapefruit is now coming through in my mouth as well. It's not all about sort of the sweet fruits. There's some sharp there as well. There's a bit of citrus. Bit of banana even it's just tropical fruit all the way through every you name it it's in there great beer try and find it guys if you can uh, as usual please 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 uh, like my Facebook page under ginger beer beer review and also share the hello I always say if you've got a friend who's into their beers then please share this video there's far too many beers to be drinking alone I always say it so please share this video with any friends you've got like my Facebook page uh, you've obviously found my YouTube channel because you're watching this video so please make sure you press the subscribe button down below drop a comment in the comments box below on the YouTube page as well as the Facebook page um, and make sure you also click on the bell icon on YouTube so that it notifies you every time I post something fresh like this beer there'll be far more of them to come I don't know if you can see the shelf back there or not there is loads of beers sitting on the shelf which I've just taken out of boxes which people have kindly sent to me. Thank you very much. We'll go through those as we do. <sighs> That's all I've got to say. Please, please like, please, please share and subscribe all the way through it. Drop me a line. Let me know what you're drinking. I'm always interested. And if you've tried any of the beers that I've reviewed, if you agree, if you disagree, I'm always interested to hear. As usual, guys, look after yourselves in these strange times and I'll see you all soon. Cheers, guys.